showing this backwards so random people on the internet don't know my address. So I ordered this September 20th. Yes, September. I didn't start, I didn't mean to say November or October. September 20th. And it's finally here. So thank you, Cofer, for slowing everything down, but it's here. Time to see what it is. Maybe I'll put what it is in the thumbnail, maybe not. Who knows? Also, I read that originally that had a bunch of posters and there's posters on the floor because they fall. But originally this had um, like Panic at the Disco and like Palais Royale posters. Now it's got a bunch of supernatural postcards and all the posters are on the ceiling. So yeah, time to open this now. Also says do not, also says do not bend because there's stuff in here. Oh, this is really stuck together. Okay. Alright, I got it. We have a tube with posters inside to protect the posters. And we got a little for that came in its own package. And then separately you have ready, ready. It's a package inside of a package. Love that. Okay, so Toronto Pilots has been my favorite band for years. And back in September, Alternative Press did a I believe it's called the Greatest Hits Collection. And they had bundles for different people on the front cover of the magazine. So they had like a Tornal Pilots bundle, and I think they had like a Water Parks one, and a My Chemical Romance one, and a few others. So I got the Tornal Pilots one. And in American dollars, it was only $18.58, I want to say. $18.58. And it came with a little Tornal Pilots photo album. So that's the front, and then that's the back. And then looking at the inside, and it's just. A couple of just double-sided photos. I think they're just about all of them black and white, just from like tour stuff. And then it came with four 21 Pilots magazines. And I don't own any of them, so that's nice. The people the people who work at Alt Press are so nice. They do they draw like little hearts and stuff. I'm trying to like cover my address so you can't see it, but they draw like little hearts on it. It's so sweet. Like I said, it came with four magazines. This is, whoa. Also, one of the, um, it came with two exclusive posters. It came with four magazines, the photo album, two exclusive posters. This is one of them. And then the other exclusive poster was in this, this little tubey tube. I want to be very, very careful with this. As you can see, I like posters because my room is literally covered in them. I'm trying like not to like accidentally tear this, taking it out of the cardboard. Also, my little brother is like right outside my door playing with those cars, so I don't know. I know half of the time I say that, like, oh, person is doing this in the room in the kitchen, and half of the time you can't actually hear it. I know sometimes you can. There we go. I didn't want to tear it. And then I got this other one. And it's got, it's got, it's got Clifford. Walter's name is Clifford, right? So yeah, I came up with two exclusive posters, four magazines, a photo book. So we've got the greatest hits one. Greatest Hits one is interesting. So it comes with the Greatest Hits magazine, of course, you've got Tonal Pilots on the cover, Fall Out Boy, Paramore, and Water Parks. I don't know why it's um, like this, but like it is. And the back, the back isn't like that. I don't know why. And then it came with um, two 35th anniversary issues. And they're actually, yeah, they're the same article. It's the same magazine bundle, just with like the two separate covers, which I think is cool that they put both of them in. I don't have either of these. That was the whole reason for getting the um, Tornal Pilots Greatest Hits one, because I didn't have any of the magazines that were included. It's even got some of the photos that were in the photo book. And then it's got, and then it's got, it's got stuff. It's got stuff. It's got, I don't know how in there, it's got Black Veil Brides a bit, Neck Deep. But yeah, you got 135th anniversary issue, and then you've got the other one. And then this one, this is an old issue. How old is this one? This is from November of 2014. Back when like the magazines were very like wide. It's got them on the front. It's got them on the back. Edition 316.1 from November 2014. Got Fearless Records ad. You got stuff about Toronto Pilots on the cover. And then of course the bit about Toronto Pilots. So yeah, I thought it would be fun if I made a quick video. I know it's a bit different just because I don't typically make content other than Pokemon on this channel, but I like a lot of things, so I thought it would be fun to just, like, hey, this thing I ordered in September is finally here, so I'm gonna make a video about it. Yeah, so like I said, November 2014 article, Greatest Hits article, or magazine, 
and then the other 35th anniversary ones photo book and then the two exclusive posters you've got, got this one and then of course that's his cleat kit and it's got like a whole bunch of like different stuff from different magazines not different magazines different music videos and stuff that's neat and then you've got the other one which i really really like if i can get it yeah okay so apparently the greatest hits magazine has old it's got old like interviews and stuff like this is from january of 2010 i don't know how well you can see it but it says up there okay you can't see it because like this is my window right here but it literally says january of 2010 right up there and it's got stuff talking about the Black Parade album, which is like super, super cool. Yeah. Okay, so the whole entire Greatest Hits magazine just has a bunch of old articles. This one is from August of 2019's Water Parks one. There's a 21 Pilots one in here. This one is from September tw 2000. September of 2018, whenever they made their comeback from the little hiatus. And then, that's neat. It's very, very neat. Okay, this might be just my favorite magazine ever because there's a page in here where it's got a picture of Josh and Tyler and it's got their handwriting of lyrics on them and it's got the second verse for Migraine written on Tyler's. And that was like, that second verse is like my favorite thing ever in the existence of like, ever. So it's got like the writing on the pictures and then it's got, if I go back one page, it's got, back in 2002, Josh had to make a contract with his parents about what he would and wouldn't do with them. And then it's got the lyrics wrote to sleep that Tyler wrote. It's so cool. And then holding on to you lyrics too. That is so cool. This is my favorite one so far. I love it. So that's it. I thought it would be fun to make a quick video talking about the fact that I ordered something in September and it's finally here and it took forever because of COVID. So yeah, quick little video. Got bored. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.